Hello, good evening, good afternoon, good morning, good night. Welcome to Sunday Night Trucking. AV's 10 out of 10, thank you, Bigfoot. Although I'm convinced you said that before I asked. <laughs> How are we doing? Are we all sweltering in this British heat wave weather? <laughs> Actually, I think it's across Europe as well. It's boiling, isn't it? Yeah. It's all well over 30 in uh, Chelmsford. It's too much, man. Too much on a bank holiday weekend. It's outrageous. Happy anniversary. It's chilly in Southern California. Why me? Well, I'm back from insomnia. <laughs> back from the NEC. Mr. New Axel, thanks for 32 months. Produce this, welcome back. Weighty with 20. Mark Stern with 32. Family are good, thank you. Welcome back, thank you, sir. Name's Rem, double top, 40 months. Generally a silent viewer. No worries, name's Rem. It's all good. Uh, Mr. Hancock, thank you for 12 months. Happy anniversary. SK Jeanbook, 63, still here. Network 17 with 14 months. Good afternoon. Spitfire with fifth, uh, 16, sorry. This button appeared again. Yeah, Twitch does that a lot. <laughs> Rusty, thank you for 31 months. Hooker Penguin, welcome back. Roy with 34. Noyon B with 58 months. One day I'll work out how to cancel this. Lol. <laughs> Thanks for the great streams and videos. Produce this with 10 months. Been MIA for a while, but glad to be back. Welcome back, sir. Welcome back. You're settling down with the gin and tonic. Oh, dude. Mika, I've had way too much alcohol this weekend. <laughs> I've had gin, I've had whiskey, I've had um, cognac, I've had cider, I've had beer. It's just, oh, I'm done for a while. <laughs> Titanic, thank you for almost a year. Red Hot in Barnsley. Yikes. Jack and Coke. Yeah. Jack and Coke's a decent drink. That was only breakfast, lol. Might as well be breakfast. Friday night, I went to bed at 2.30. And then was up again at 8. <laughs> Mixing spirits. Oh, yeah, I forgot about all the Jaeger bombs as well. On Saturday night. There's at least three rounds of Jaegers on Saturday night. Did we win the poke quiz? <laughs> you must be joking. I think we got about half the questions right. The winning team oh, yeah, got yeah, yeah. Um, two, uh, no, four wrong, I think it was, the winning team. Four questions wrong. I think we got about half of them wrong. <laughs> there was one, one point separating first and second. Now, Sutty, what you need, mate, is, a, is a, a nice pizza, a nice cup of tea before bed, sleep it off, nice breakfast, and you're good to go. What were the winnings of the pub quiz? Uh, there was £3,000 worth in total. I think the second, the third place team gets like 250 300 Second gets about uh, 400 500 third, First place gets about 800 and then they all give it to special effect. So special effects is the charity. The expectation is that if you win or come second off, if you win anything, you just instantly give the check to special effect. Although the team that came second got on the stage and said, uh, "We are we are keeping the winnings," and everybody went boo, and they went because we're going to gift aid it to special effect, and they went yay. <laughs> Mr. Gamai, thank you for seven months. Wish you a nice Sunday night trucking. I hope so too. Poppinopolis, thank you for 200 bits. Just a good afternoon, just up, up the A12. Ooh, near Colchester. I expect. Welcome back, Gabby. Glenn, 53 months. Thanks again for the merch. We are fighting over the squirrel pen. Lol. <laughs> Uh, 
Right, so anyway, um, in other news, tonight there won't be a wheel cam, I'm afraid. The wheel cam is here. This be the wheel cam. And uh, it will not be in action tonight. Uh, it's supposed to sit on here. On this arm, it's supposed to like do that. Uh, so there's going to be no wheel cam. I'll tell you why. Because I managed, I don't know if you can see this or not, but um, I managed to knock my seat into the cable that goes into it. And I don't know if you can make it out or not, but that inside there is the other half of the HDMI cable. <laughs> you see that bit on the left? On the right is a USB, and on the left is a HDMI. And that's the, that's the HDMI cable that should be on the end of this cable here, and it's now in there. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I did that about an hour ago. So I literally, like, turned the chair, it hit the cable, and just snapped it off inside the GoPro. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I need to get my pliers and pull that piece of metal back out again. So I need to get the pliers and yank that out. I think it'll be fine. I just need a new cable. So I'll order, I'll have to, I've ordered another cable from Amazon, but that will be here some Monday. Indeed, careful use of pliers needed, which is why I'm not going to rush it tonight, and I haven't got a spare cable anyway, so... Yeah, no, no second camera, basically. <laughs> Slipper cam. Oh yeah, oh yeah, Jaws. Let, let me just connect the third camera that I don't have with a cable that I don't have, and you can have a slipper cam. Good idea. <laughs> Why didn't I think of that? <laughs> a tweezer will work better, quite possibly. I need to ask Mrs. Squirrel if she's got some tweezers for that. Yeah, I just need to, like, carefully extract it. Jaws, I would appreciate if you don't tell me to shut it. Thank you very much. I wouldn't expect you to talk like that to anybody else in the stream, yet alone me. Use a magnet. Well, I don't have a cable anyway, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> I can't pull it out because I don't have a cable. <clears throat> Trucks in fam, welcome back. MTA, thank you for 19 months. Right, let's go and drive over and configure a truck, shall we? Uh, Chris? Oh, sorry, Chris. I completely missed that. Squirrel, uh, safe and sound back in Chelmsford. Just about back in Chelmsford. Uh, how are you doing? It was great to meet you yesterday. I'm still in Birmingham, but we'll uh, be going home tomorrow morning. So Chris, Chris gave, came all the way from Norway and gave me these. Let me see this or not. Chris gave me these, which is like a, I think it's like a Norwegian Kit Kat, I believe. Is that right, Chris? It's like a Norwegian Kit Kat. So I've got those. So thank you very much, Chris. Um, I think it was SF Giants gave me this thing. So he gave me um, this Arizona Paul Avenue. And also a... Mr. Squirrel's not seen this yet. I love my Westy Magnet. So that was from... I think that was from SF Giants. And then Vrom gave me, as, as Vrom does, Vrom literally brought like four boxes of these waffles from Belgium. So he's, he's dished out a whole load of waffles to people, and I've got some. Um, and then, I think it was Scania Loving Cookie. Um, I don't know if you can see this or not, but he made these. But unfortunately, one of them has been damaged in transit. Uh, it's basically a chocolate Westie. But one's, one's got a broken leg now, unfortunately. <laughs> Whoops. And also this which I hope you can see. Uh, I might have to take it out of this packet so you can see it properly one second. Uh, it's, it's a solid block of chocolate. Actually, there's two in here. There's a, a light chocolate and a dark chocolate version, I think. I'll try and be careful with this. So this is made out of chocolate. Can you see that? Happy anniversary. It says the nut house, and it's got acorns on it and the squirrel on it and then it's even got like scumbag on it look at that i'm gonna put it back in before it starts melting Welcome back. 
So that was some scanny loving cookie. Oh man, I can smell the chocolate. And then Baz brought a load of these. So I've had a, a resupply on the Spezzy. Or the Spezzy, as he likes me to say. But I just say Spezzy. So he's, he brought me some of them. And also, um, he brought me a box of Hanuta. Which is a, a very nice, like, chocolate nut waffle thing. Which, these are delicious. I love these. So these are nice. And... He brought me two of his favourite Bavarian beers. If you can see those. Welcome to the nut house. Two of his favourite Bavarian beers for me to enjoy. So I got that. And then finally, I got gifted this. From, uh, from Mikey Farr. To the nut house. Which I've not opened yet. Any guesses as to what this might be? From Mikey Farr? I know what it is. Just just in case I run out, Mikey thought he better get me some more. <laughs> Another four million tea bags. Which will last me about three weeks. <laughs> so thank you from uh, from Mikey Far for that. So yeah. Gifts were exchanged, selfies were taken, things were signed. Lots of stuff happened. Um, and I think there was a sub bomb from. Oh, I need to look back. Who was the sub bomb from? Uh, Trauma, was it? No. Scania. Scania 46, it was. Gifted five subscriptions, is that correct? Is it four or five? I think it's five. Thank you very much, Scania 46, uh, for your kind support. And please remember to give him a thank you if you just got a sub there. You were lucky enough to get a free sub. Dark Variable. Good afternoon to you. Thank you for the bits. Happy anniversary. Hope you're well. Um, MTA slave for 19 months. Trying to make sure I don't miss anybody. Trucks in fan. Welcome back. It was five subs. Thank you, Scania. Bit too fast. Whoa. 60 months. Five years of lurking on the best Twitch streamer. Here's to the next five. Keep doing what you do best. Thank you so much, dude. Five years support. Every now and again, you need to come out of lurking and say something just to show off your acorn. <laughs> X Arsis, thank you for eight months. Welcome back. Thank you, dude. Right, let's get this show on the road, show. We've got a truck to configure here. This might take a bit of time. So let's go and do that. Do I feel like a celebrity? Let, let, hang on, bef before we move anywhere, let me tell you how much of a celebrity I feel. So we go to Insomnia, and people are asking my mods, where do I meet Squirrel? Some are, some are bumping into me as we walk around, right? That's cool. But some people are asking, where do I meet? So I think, okay, I'll tell you what, I'll do a meet and greet. So I look around the NEC, I'm looking around going, where's the best place to do a meet and greet here? And I see these signs hanging down. Meet and greet area A, meet and greet area B. Okay? So I push a tweet out saying, let's meet up. At meet and greet area B, 1.30 p.m. So 1.30 p.m. comes. I go over to the meet and greet area B. Sure enough, people are waiting there. So we stand around, you know, start like chatting and like giving out pens and stuff like that. Security comes and says, uh, you need to move. I was like, what? Yeah, you need, you need to move. You can't have a meet and greet here. Wait, what? Yeah, we have to keep these... We have to keep these walkways free for health and safety reasons. You need to move. So I moved about 10, 15 meters and stopped again. So here you go. It's nice and nice and quiet here. Let's stop here. Let's let's have a chat here with, with, with the old fans. Somebody else comes up and says, Oh, excuse me. I appreciate what you're trying to do, meeting your fans, but you can't have a meet and greet area inside the NEC. What? <laughs> Where am I supposed to have a meet and greet then? You need to go outside in the courtyard. <laughs> Wait a minute. So this meet and greet area that you've got, right? And it's got like snaked queue that goes up to a desk. 
basically, if you're big enough, you can you can obviously get a meet and greet time and book yourself into that thing. But because I'm obviously not big enough, and I meet fans on the fly, you know, underneath the meet and greet sign, they tell me to just disappear and go outside with my fans. <laughs> so, so what we did was we decided we're just going to walk. So if we keep moving, we're not actually having a meeting, are we? So we just walk really slowly along the along the walkways and chat. Like, nope, don't stop, guys. Keep going. Keep going. And then we're not having a meeting. So we just walked all the way around. Eventually got to the outer edge of the NEC where it was quiet again and just stood at the wall and just... But it was like... <laughs> yeah. Did I feel like it? Did I feel like a celebrity? Not really. Not when security were telling me to move. <laughs> <laughs> you ache on hype bit too fast. Told you. Uh, Mr. Zinam, 35 months. You know what this means? One more month until a new acorn. Last of the golden acorn, Mr. Zinam. Lord Bongo, welcome back. Papadopoulos, thank you for your support, sir. Gutman, welcome back. Mikey Farr, 22 months. It was good to see you yesterday. And I'm so nearly on two year hype. I missed you opening the gift as I'm on. SR right now, I'll have to send you another Kappa. Mikey, I opened it. Thank you very much, sir. I did show it off. We oh, unpacked yeah. it live. I think we're going left. What are we driving today? You'll find out in about 60 seconds. Petrol head, thank you for the bits. Uh, it's me, Reaper, just stopping by to say goodbye as I can't keep up with your streams, so no more. I've been around for two years now, and I need to go my own way, so I'll be seeing you and the Nut House. Uh, I'll miss you guys. Might stop by one day, but I doubt it. All right. Uh, Petrol Headster, thank you very much for um, for being here. Hope to see you again in the near future. All the best, sir. Uh, Tim Redman, welcome back. Mr. Sun X, thank you for seven months. Here's to many more. What do you mean, Sommy? If you get reply to email that you type while standing over the wall. Sommy, what, what email? What email did you send, Sommy? I, I can think of a few things that you could have had a moan about, Sommy. <laughs> We're driving a Merc tonight. Yep. Why not? We'll drive a Merc tonight. Mikey Farr, see you later, sir. Right, we're going to drive an MP3. But it's the modded version of the MP3. And I've got a couple of extra accessories that might make things slightly more interesting. Yeah, classic work. Bit of MP3 action, why not? You sent a rage unanimous email in the events. You just scrap. Oh, right, okay. Do you mean anonymous? It's on me. Or did you actually send an email that, from your email address? <laughs> Welcome back. Did I complain? No, I think, I've not complained yet, no. I should do. I should complain, really, shouldn't I? But then, what, they'll, they'll probably just turn around and say, well, you know, you should have told us you wanted to have a meet and greet and then we could have booked you in. And then, I know for well, if you do, they'll be like, oh, there's no spaces. Because <laughs> you're not like the, the size of PewDiePie, so you can't have a meet and greet area. It should be good on tea for a bit. Yeah. Really wish you could have been an insomnia, Loopy Loo. You had a stroke on the 11th of August. You've not been feeling well off this wing. Weekend. I hope you're okay, Loopy Loo. One day you'll be that big and you can show them. Yeah, one day I'll I'll, I'll be the size of PewDiePie and I'll be like, I'm not even going to come to your event. I'm going to somewhere else. I'm going to have a meet outside in the courtyard. I'm not even going to buy a ticket. <laughs> I think PewDiePie just got 100 million subs this week. <laughs> Which is just like, what? 
A hundred million. How does that even work? I did miss your resub, Yen Freak. I can't even see it. I do apologize. Benjem, welcome back. Hold your own event. Do you know what, ED? That'd be awesome. We could hold Squirrel Con. Wait, I don't know. Where would we hold Squirrel Con? How about buy an oak tree in, in like Harlands Park in Chelmsford? <laughs> Squirrel Con. Just buy an oak tree. <laughs> welcome back. Oh. Not that we'd have any like PCs or you know gaming stuff. <laughs> St. Helens, as if it gotta be in Chelmsford, surely. Mickard, I apologize, mate. Things have scrolled off the screen, I've missed them. If I've missed your resub, I apologize and thank you for your support. But I can't realistically scroll back through this massive list of oh, those mech cards with a 12 month one thank you for a year titanic with 11 months uh produce this with 10 i've probably missed a couple i'm sorry about that i was talking too much a meet and greet at local pub you've not seen my local pub while <laughs> Right, um, 4 by 2 what's this then? Is that going to second fuel tank? Ooh. Wow, that's that's long range, blimey. The second fuel tank on it. Go to different countries. Oh, yeah. Just, just jet around. I keep telling you one day, one day, we're going to hire a Scania truck. Motley's going to drive it. And then we're going to have a big trailer on the back that's black and says like squirrel logistics. And then inside, it's going to have like PCs and stuff. It's going to like open up like one of those F1 trailers and have like PC gaming in it. And then we're going to go on a Euro tour, just drive it around Europe and stop in different cities, different countries. Just plug it in, plug in the internet. That's, that's what we're talking about. That would look awesome look amazing will it have beer of course it'll have beer <laughs> it'll have a, a fridge right up in the front air conditioned <laughs> it would work better than what insomnia did i'll probably get a better 4g connection as well right engine wise whiteland says go whiteland says go 510 i think that's what he said he said don't go small this time don't go big go 510 so that's what we'll do Transmission, 16 speed. You what, mate? 16 speed? I think we'll take the retarder if we're going to do that. Just one fridge. Dude, have you seen the size of my fridge? <laughs> yeah, we only need one fridge. <laughs> Since when do we listen to Whiteland? That's harsh. Uh right, interior. Let's let's have a quick look at the interior. It's automatic. Ooh. Look at this. Blue display. Blue display. Actually, if if you put it on auto, it gets rid of the clutch oh, yeah, pedal yeah, as well. Yeah. That's kind of cool. Who sub bombed? Scania again. Scania forty six dropped another five subs. Thank you very much, Scanny. If you just got a sub, please give him a thank you. That's 10 subs he's gifted tonight. Thank you so much, Scanny. What about a barbecue? Uh, you'll, have to, you'll have to sort that out yourselves. If you want a barbecue at SquirrelCon, you'll have to deal with it yourself. Somebody will bring a barbecue, I'm sure. We'll have a support truck. We'll have a support truck with white and driving it. That's what we'll do. The support van. And in the back will be white and beer. And like barbecues and stuff. <laughs> Zen, um, I'm, I posted most of them on Twitter. I completely forgot to post them on Instagram. I ended up shoving them on Twitter. My bad. Uh, let's see. UK. No. Trust edition. Absolutely no. Blue display with auto. We'll go manual and have the blue display. I don't know what that's going to look like. Let's try and get a nice colour going here. What have we got? Gold liner. 
black liner. Back in the MP3 days, the paint skins were a little bit subdued, shall we say. Not fancy brown, though. I mean, that's all right, but... Is that a bit too showy? Maybe it's a bit too showy. Maybe we just go with, like, a non-metallic color. Happy Hang on, what's all this? Nutter. Heavy Duty Surge, blimey. Fifty Shades of Brown. <laughs> Make a good book, though. Uh, Super Sky Snake, thank you for 27. Full on James May Brown styling. Yeah. So I just think metallic is probably too much for a Happy anniversary. An MP3. So I might just go for a custom color. Find something a bit. Like a near black color like that. Yeah, see, that's lighter. Something like that. Like a near black. That'll do. We're not going sunburst orange, Chris. <laughs> Imp, thank you for nine months. Thank you, sir. Welcome Enjoy back. that Twitch, baby. <laughs> Scania, dude, you've already dropped two lots of five, and now you've just dropped another ten. What the heck, man? Scania 46, keeping the sub bombs rolling. Thank you very much. Back. And if you just got gifted a sub, please give me a thank you. Thank you, Scania 46. That's 20 is gifted. Bombs away, indeed. Okay. Now we get onto the externals. This is where it starts to get a bit Welcome more interesting. No. First of all, we're going to get a side panel on here. Uh, this side skirt stock paint is not compatible with S equip. Mm, that might be Welcome the that might be the fuel. Oh no! I don't know what I got rid of. Possibly the exhaust. Ooh, fuel tank black. That's cool. Welcome back. Ainsley, dude, what the heck? What's going on? Ainsley? Let's just match Scania's 20 with his own 20. Holy moly. My panel just went Christmas tree on me. Ainsley, thank you very much for dropping 20 subs. Houses. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of resubs and a whole bunch of new subs in that list. New emote slot soon. Uh, yeah, well, not likely one. <laughs> We've got a long way to go to get back up the, the heady heights of Christmas deliveries. Ainsley, thank you very much, sir. Please give him a thank you if you got gifted a sub. Soon everyone watching will be subbed. You're not far, you're not, uh, far off of that. Tank Chrome. Matter. Stock, stock V2. Okay, that's what it got rid of. That's what it got rid of. I like the black tanks, though. They're pretty cool. Let's have some colored cables. Bring a bit of color in here. Who is the top sub gifter? I don't know. It's probably in the... If you go to the Twitch page, it's on the leaderboard list, though. I think. Plastic. Welcome back. I prefer if they had a painted version, but we'll take it. The only problem with this Welcome is it back. doesn't have the option for the bar. Why doesn't it have the option for the bar? Hmm, let me get rid of that a second. Welcome back, Nutter. It should be a sidebar. It's V for 250 subs. Yikes, there you go. Welcome back. 
Uh, yes, Mrs. Frosty. Jonesy, thank you for 32 months. Plymouth Reliant, thank you for 59. I'm trying to work out why we haven't got the bar here since we've got the four. Oh, it's probably because we chose that chassis and not that one. Welcome yeah, back. there you go. Nata. Yeah, that's what it is. That's better. Yeah. Okay. We'll have to go for the non-fuel tank because if we don't, we can't put a bar down here. I don't want the bar. Hydraulic system instead of a spare tire. Hydraulic system black. Welcome back. Not All right, let's just leave it on the spare tire, I think. Painted the black tanks, stock V2. And then this is what I want to show you, the Kelsa bar. There's a Kelsa sidebar, but you can get this one. This one's painted. Welcome back. So it sits alongside like that. And then it's painted, and then on the Kelsa sidebar, we can put these things, which give us a nice, like, uh, lit up. Like, there's various colors of LED. We can do this, like that, Welcome and then back. we can go like that, Not and then like that. We can do that kind of thing, which looks, I think, looks pretty cool. Especially on a dark gray like that. How am I? I'm good, thank you. The exhaust is ugly. Can't do much about it. Um, but that's like the green color. But you could also do, for Welcome example, back. blue. Nutter. Depends what look you go for. Personally, I'd like it if you could get rid of these lights as well and just change them how you want. But, you know, it's pretty neat, I think. Lots, lots of choices Welcome in here. To the nut house. Lots and lots of choices. Strobe only. Blinker, strobe, blinker EU, blimey. Scania 46 is back in there with another, another 10 subs gifted. Oh my God. Bringing Scania's total this evening up to 30 subs gifted. Wowzers. More nutters in the nut house. Such generosity. Thank you, Scania. Thank you, Scania 46. I miss a sub gift, yours. Who from? It's kind of hard to keep track right now. What happened, yours? Oh, from Whiteland to gift us a sub to 300. <laughs> to the Thank you, Whiteland. <clears throat> I think we're going with that because that looks funky. I'll put the painted bar down. We'll go with the green Welcome light there. And we'll try and do the same on the front lower bar, if we can. Try and keep that effect running here as well. I just wish I could get rid of that. Just slightly spoils it, but I can't get rid of it. Welcome to the nut house. I'm taking over from Ninja. Right. Get to the nut on the mud flat. Right, here you go. So the Kelsa low bar. That one will be the painted one. So you can go with that, or you can have low bar plastic step for here. I think we'll have that. Welcome to the nut house. And then we'll put green all around here. Kinda hard to see what dots are going. <coughs> These dots are like irregularly spaced. Like I don't understand why there's two here. There's one there, one there. That looks like it's on the bar. Happy anniversary, Nutter. Okay, that's like behind the bar or something. What's that then? It's almost under the bar. It'd have to be like that, I'm afraid. 
Devil Dude getting in on the sub bomb action with a sub bomb of five. Thank you so much, Devil Dude. You guys are having bombs dropped on you like crazy. <laughs> Thank you for gifting five subs, Devil Dude. Happy anniversary. It's crazy. Nata. Right, so that I don't want on the mud flaps. We've got that done. We've got this. This is DRL, which goes here. I think that looks a little awkward. Happy anniversary. It's like the DRL sits right on top of that grill. I'd have preferred if the DRL was here or something. I'd like to have DRL, but I, I, I think back. it spoils the look, though. Nata. Right, what does that one do? Accessories Welcome F underscore back. LP. Nata. Okay. License plate, I take it. It's going to stick the license plate here, I assume. All right. Kelsa LED bar. What's that going to sit? We've got an LED bar there. That looks... Okay. <laughs> okay, group, group Pierre just decided to roll 25 into the mix. Welcome back. <laughs> well, it must be the heat. <laughs> Group Priya, thank you very, very much for gifting 25 subs to the channel. Dropping 25 bombs and Welcome lots back. of new subs getting hoovered up there. Lots of first timers, lots of resubs. Thank you very, very much, Group Priya. Um, please remember to give me a thank you if you get gifted that sub. Yeah, it's very warm. I think it's making people delirious. <laughs> Um, some guys are new to the nut house. New subs. Welcome. Wow. Thank you, sir. Thank you very, very much. The love is real. You're not joking. I think that looks amazing. I really like that. But well, I want to see what this does. So that puts a bar right in front of the registration plate. You could probably hang lights from that, but... You got the Euro bar, which sits like that. To the nut house. Which I'm not massively keen on. What does the multi bar do? Oh, no, the multi -bar, the multi bar looks pretty cool. If I just change its color a sec, so you can actually see it. Welcome to the nut house. That's quite decent. I think it looks better than the um, than the Euro bar. Because oh, the yeah, Eurobar yeah. just looks like it's going. <laughs> Welcome back. First time catching the stream live. Welcome. You gotta get to work in 15, Navarine. Have a good day at work. Do the multicolored lights uh, come with the Kelsa bar separate mod? It's a separate mod, folks. Uh, I found I found the mod for the for the bar. Motley will put it in the spreadsheet shortly. I found the mod for the bars. Um, they work with most of the trucks that come with uh, from SCS. Welcome this is a modded truck, but because it replaces the because it replaces the existing MP3, this the Kelsa bar seems to work with it. And the lights, yeah, the lights are a separate mod again. They've got lots of colors, and you can just drop them wherever you like. Really, they don't need the Kelsa mod. Happy anniversary. Uh, Captain Flint's pole, the left side should be red, not green, Kappa. <laughs> uh, so let's just see what other bars we've got. Okay, that's it. So, decision time. Do we go for Welcome that? Back. The multi bar, like that? It sounds like the milky bar. Or just a straight bar there. Let's go with the multi bar, because that's, that's different. So maybe. Back. Nutter. 
do something like that. They, li they line up nicely with that, which I'm happy about. You could even just leave it like that if you didn't want to go too over the top. You could just leave it. Or you can start sticking a light here. Um, I think rectangular light would work best for this truck. I have a lot of circular lights. I don't have a huge amount of rectangular lights. But there are some. Like that, but... I'm inclined not to. I could even put like the small light on it. But I think it'd look a bit weird. Welcome to the nut house. Like that kind of thing. But I think it just looked very, very odd. Um I say you can put the round lights on, but they probably I think Maybe we'll put a green dot there instead. I think that's probably a better look. It's like subtle, you know. Welcome to the well, the bacon, we'll, we'll put the bacon on the top, you know. You just came back and saw that you've been gifted a sub. There's been lots of sub bombage, shall we say. Did I get any steak? Uh, no. I had a burger. And I had a pizza. Still a Beedo. Are you still at the NEC, Dave? Welcome back, Nutter. Stock or glow? Definitely glow. Plastic grey paint. Welcome back, Nutter. Yeah, we'll keep it like that. Now there's scope for more lights. You still there, Dave? Whew, I was done, man. Zoltar, 55 months. Hope you're well. Can't stay for the streams. There's family in town, but have a good stream. Thank you, Zoltar. Have a good day, sir. Uh, if you got gifted a sub before and it's expired now, can you get gifted a sub again? Yeah. You can get gifted a sub anytime, but when people do Welcome sub bombs, it, like it's completely Welcome. random who gets one. You was tired last night. It was in bed before 1 a.m. Dude, I think we were all wrecked last night. Welcome back. We just, I think all of us went to bed before midnight. It was, it was quite bizarre. <laughs> Everybody was just done. But that's what you get for drinking like alcohol and shorts till 2.30 a.m. on the Friday. Welcome back. Uh, Calcaspos, thank you. So what I don't want to do is overdo the lighting here. So let's think about the line of that there. Welcome Possibly like that, house. and like that, and like that. And just do that with it. Just to kind of create a basic shape. Welcome to the nut house. 20 years old is fine for shots, isn't it? Like 22, you passed it. The one green is in the wrong place. Yes, it is. I did it deliberately to, to see if you would notice, and you did. So you get the cookie. I might take this one away. Oh no, you scumbag. Scumbag game. I hate it when it puts an X over the top of something that you want to click on. It's so annoying. Right, there you go. What? We'll get there in a sec. Welcome to the Nut House. There we go. <clears throat> the green's still wrong. No, it's not. Welcome to the it's Nut fine. House.
That's enough green on there. Now, if Rome's still in the UK, Dave, he's just waiting for his um, train back through the tunnel. Welcome to the nut house. Wait, what? Rain sensor? Rain sensor, rain sensor, rain sensor doable. I have no idea what this is. To the nut house. Is it going to be a rain sensitive wiper? And if that's the case, what's the difference between that and that? It's actually put Welcome something in the window, you see it. Actually, put something though. Uh, Volska, thank you for 23. Okay. Leave that. Let's go up here. It's for the cutout of the rain sensor. Does it actually do anything or not? Is it just cosmetic? Stock, stock green. Doesn't look green. Oh yeah, just a tinge of green though. You see it? Just an absolute tinge of green. Welcome back, Nata. Yeah, I don't want text. That's quite decent like that. Green works as well. Welcome back. Your train's at eight o'clock, bro. You have to be there like 15 minutes before, though. Okay, high buy visor mount. That's a lot of dots. The back bar. Welcome back. Admiral Welcome back bar. Oh, nice. I like Admiral back bar. That's quite good, actually. The high bar. Hey. Let's go with the. High by visor, visor mount. Let's do that. Okay, now we get some lights up here. Now, what we could do... Let's put some green, green action up here as well. Some green action up there. And then set some lights on top in between. Too many dots. Welcome to the nut house. Uh, you're going racing tomorrow at uh, Lydon Racetrack in Kent. I've 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 been on that track. You're a track. It's about one mile long that track. I went round that on um, Ari Latum, <laughs> which was nuts. I don't think spotlights on the roof is going to work out too well Happy so get some nice hellas up there Nutter. it's just a matter of getting the right style of hella I'm thinking the painted ones that's a fully painted one why is that blue when it says white Happy anniversary, Nutter. You see, that's painted with a chrome trim. Which. Yeah, let's have a look. It almost works. We have got a chrome trim going on here. Uh, Boken, thank you for three months. Loving every minute. Thanks, Boken. Yeah, if you drive an Aerial Atom around uh, Lydon Racetrack, they only let you do it in fifth gear. <laughs> I'm not joking. It's that powerful. 